see you. There is a different face on the floor at the setting position. It's 21. Lily Nicholson. Riley Buckley has back row. Holly, I want to ask you, having played at two different colleges and going back and playing your old school, what is it like for Melanie Parra right now to face her old team? Well, from my own experience, it was a huge emotional experience, even though I chose to leave and she chose to leave as well. It's, it's hard. It's a team that you've spent a lot of time with. And you have his CCU too because of her first contact as well. Yeah, that was something they dearly missed in the West Virginia match. She missed three sets in their match against Oklahoma. Had to come out of that one and they missed all of the West Virginia match. And Melanie Parra, no surprise, we see her in the ace. Melanie Parra has one of the best serves I've ever seen. She gets on this ball so quickly. These Texas players have seen it before and they still can't pass it. come in off the bench for Texas and do that. Back to back. Don't forget it. Melanie's reminding them yeah. that they forgot. <laughs> the confidence, the rhythm of her serve and the pace bounces right off Emma Halter. She had a Texas record 60 aces as a freshman in 2021. Even though that was not an ace, that ball had so much spin that the setter could not set it. Jason Williams, the head coach of TCU, and he, yeah, we talked about her numbers when it comes to attacking, but you can't forget the all-around game that she has brought to TCU. First time playing her old team, missed the last match with an injury, but she is back. Jenna Willis, the transfer from Minnesota, is stuck by Bree Green. Bree Green is long at the net. Watch her get way up high. She's a defensive force, and if Texas continues to go high and outside, she's going to be able to get out there and close that block. It's a 5 0 run for TCU. You know, it's a weapon in the front row, Holly, and you said? I used to think so. Oh, yeah. I don't know that. Because 
because she's got so much pace off of her hand that that one, the off speed works. Because Melanie Para is taking care of business and serving the perfect pass. And look how fast that ball is. Melanie Para, quick on that ball, attacking through the seam. Her back in the middle. Nicholson out to Para. Makes it look so easy. And it was a one-arm stab on defense by Audrey Knowles, of course. Look at the one arm to keep it alive. And then the fastball out to Para, who's been able to score for TCU in the set. And they extend it with a Melanie Parra block. This ball is set a little bit. She's trying to find a way to struggle to pass. They struggle to the tacky ears. Oh, Ellis Swindle took that one to the face. Wow. Para unloaded. They gave her a sliver of line and she found it. Para flies out of the back row. Melanie Para is special. She's so fun to watch. It just looks effortless. She pops off the ground. The arm speed. TCU leading the match two sets to one. They are one set win away. Doesn't face Melanie Parra. Right back to work. Nope. Just enough. Paintbrush kill 